Praise the Lord. Praise him, praise him. Must have been the hand of the Lord. How's everybody doing today? Oh, <laughs> you get this shoulder. I know. <laughs> Ooh, I just used my shoulder. <laughs> use your shoulder, mama. <laughs> hey. Somebody touch me. I feel the Holy Ghost. Yes. Welcome to the Spirit of Truth podcast. Must have been the hand of the Lord. All right now. What you say? <laughs> Glory to God. <laughs> See what the end is gonna be. How many gonna run on? I'm gonna run. <laughs> praise the Lord, everybody. Praise, praise, praise the Lord. Yes, praise God, praise God. I'm gonna get that. <laughs> Mama got it in her shoulders today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the Holy Ghost. <laughs> praise the Lord. Praise, praise the Lord. Lord. Praise the Lord, everyone. And welcome to the Spirit of Truth podcast. We just thank yes. and praise God for being here today. Give God all the praise, yes, the glory, glory, and the honor. Amen. I want to take this time to honor my husband, Pastor Barry Jones Sr. Amen. We thank God for him. And we believe stand for what you believe in. Come on now. Even if it means standing alone. Hey. But guess what? God has a remnant, so you will not be standing on, alone. Man. I just thank God today. Listen, mm. y'all don't know who I have with me today. <laughs> Listen, I got somebody special with me today. Mm. I have with me Mother and Felicia Prophetess Thomas. I thank God for her. This is the woman of God that led me to Christ. Thank you, Jesus. When I was walking in the spirit of darkness, when I was in my sin, this is the chosen individual that God put in my path to Tell witness him. to me. And here I am. Hey, here I am. On, over 20 years later. Come on. Girl. Over 20 years over later. Who? Over 20 years over later. Who? Over 20 Woo! years later. Hey, Glory, to you, Glory be to God. Over 20 some years ago. Thank you, so I thank God for her. And I thank God for her coming out today and Amen. coming to you by way of Spirit or Truth podcast. And y'all know we got a word from the Lord today. <laughs> so, again, Mother Felicia Thomas. Now, we're going to talk uh, this morning. Um, Mom, I call her Mama. God told Amen. me years ago, he said, stop calling her sister. He said, call her mother. Because the word says, rebuke not an elder, but entreat him as a father. It says the older women as mother mm -hmm. and the younger as sister. Y'all know what the scriptures say. So me and Mama was rejoicing the other Amen. day. And the spirit what of the Lord say? came in. Hallelujah. And we began to rejoice. And the Lord began to speak concerning how preachers, have blood on Ooh, their hands. Hey, come on now. Ooh, how Ooh, preachers hallelujah. have blood on their hands. And I'm going to turn her loose. Mm. Listen, she don't really need no introduction. I'm going to turn her loose and let the Lord have his way. And so, Mama, we're talking about in this day and in this time, how preachers don't understand that having blood on your hand mm -hmm. it's a dangerous position to be in when the lord returns. Mm -hmm. and i just want you to expound some of the things uh just briefly mm -hmm. when we were rejoicing that day the scriptures came in about enter in at the straight gate yes we discussed that we talked about that narrow way, narrow way. and then we talked about how it says uh not everyone that's saying to me lord lord, lord gonna is going to enter in mm -hmm. we talked about that and then we even went about you ran well, but, but who, who did hinder you? We went on that. Okay, and then we went to who bewitched you. you. Ooh. Man, who turned you away? Man. From the truth. Who bewitched you and turned you from the truth? And so, Mama, you come in your own way and talk to us about this topic, and, and let's, let's just let the Lord have his way. I just want to emphasize on this right here. When God spoke to me concerning about the blood dripping off the preacher's hand mm -hmm. and the prophetess hand, mm -hmm. hallelujah, glory be to the Lamb of God, is because when he told Ezekiel, mm -hmm. 
He said, "You gonna, you gonna, I, you gonna warn? I want you to warn these people, mm -hmm. huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. At least the blood gonna be what on your hand. on your hand. That's right. That's right. It's not to change from that time to this time. That's right. Because when God set you up, He meant for you to." Warn the warn people. Warn the people. We're not in this for favoritism. So we're not in this for friendships. Mm -hmm. We're not in for buddies. Yes. We ain't here for salvation. Yes. We ain't here for true living for Christ and Christ only. You know, I was. Uh, I'm seeing this more and more, and it's becoming more mm. and more how. I'm seeing that uh, preachers are becoming just this little sensitive. Like you hear this, don't judge, yeah. and, you know, y'all judging, and yeah. you know, people need to mind their own business. Yeah. God didn't call us to mind our own business. Our business. He called us to preach the gospel. He said, preach repentance. Come on, repentance and remission of sin, and that is what He called us to do. And we just getting this little, you know, jellyback thing going where nobody wants to disturb anybody nobody wants to offend anybody so you 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 go ahead mama but you know what it is though i would be honest with you a lot of them just don't have the backbone no more mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We, we, we always come up in the law and during the time that you had got to live and got yes. the holy ghost by god we was obedient unto the word of god yes it wasn't no question it wouldn't ask him why why what yes yes why what that's right the bible says just gotta obey. be obedient yes huh so I thank God for the word is because that's why I live off. Mm -hmm. I don't live off just what men say. If they say the word, they say, I'm living off that. Yes, that's huh? right. What's written. The scripture say we clean through what? The word. Through the word. Yes. And once you be washed through the word by God yes. and let it soak in you. Yes. Huh? Yes. Meditate yes. on this word. Day and what? Night. Night. Yes. And this word will live. It will walk up and down in you. Mm. It will speak to you. It will guide you. It will teach you. Mm -hmm. It will lead you into all truth. That's what the Bible says. Because right. the Holy Ghost and the Word is the same. Yes. There's no separation. Yes. It's all together. Together. That's right. right. That's right. So that's why the Bible says, He that have an ear, let them hear what the what? What the Spirit are speaking unto the church. It seems that people question uh, nowadays if the Spirit is speaking through a vessel. There's so much question. It's like you can be speaking directly from the right throne him. of grace. Mm. And it's like there's so many questions. Like I, I didn't have that question. Like when you minister me and brought me in, it's like I, I never you was hungry. second get you was hungry. But I'm gonna tell you religion people is not hungry no mm -hmm, more. Mm -hmm, huh? Mm -hmm. You heard what I said? I said religion people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I didn't say Holy Ghost filled mm -hmm, people. Mm -hmm. Religion people are not hungry. Mm -hmm. Because when you really got the Holy Ghost in you, you're going to continue to be hungry and thirst after, after righteousness. righteousness. See, that don't leave you. See, it's something about you supposed to have that same zeal. When you heard the word from the... When I first heard the word, I began to get hungry. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, huh? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You want more and more. I began to get thirsty. Mm. Mm. Huh? I want more, mm -hmm. and that that desire never left me. Yes. I don't know about everybody yes, else, yes. but hey, I still get excited yes. about the word. Yes, I Lord. still get hungry for the word. Yes. I don't care if I've been this thirty-seven years. Now, come on, I still <laughs> yes. get hungry. Yes. Yes. Listen, 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 pump, pump the brakes. Oh pump my pump God, the brakes. God, my God. <laughs> let me pump. Let me let me stop for a minute. Look, oh my God, it's, people don't understand. You got to keep up. When you love God, mm -hmm. when you love the word. Everybody that talked to me, I, I'm excited for the word of mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. huh? Hungry and thirst. I'm thirsty and hungry every day yes. for the spirit of things of God to walk up right before you. Examine myself. Yes. Huh? Yes. Examine myself. Make sure I ain't got no blood. On your hand. On my hand. And that's what I was just fixing to say. You know, whatever you eat the most, mm. that's what you crave. I've learned this. Yeah. Whatever you eat the most, that's what you crave. You begin mm -hmm. to crave what you put it into your system. Come on now. And go, this is how we're going to lead up into what Ezekiel mm -hmm. told the uh, people. Go ahead. You know, if you're not, if you're giving a sugar coated message, mm -hmm. that's what the people are going to crave. Yes. But if you give the unadulterated word of God, that is what people are going to crave. Mm. Now, listen to this. He says, son of man, I have made thee a watchman under the house of Israel. And he said, therefore, hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me. You know what I like? Son of man, mm. I have made you a watchman. Mm. Okay? 
That's where the ship will come in. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I have made you. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I have put you, son of man, mm -hmm. over these people mm -hmm. to watch. To watch. Mm. I feel the Holy Ghost. You probably <laughs> all right. You supposed to be looking. Yes. Huh? Yes. And whatever you see, you supposed to call what? it out. Yes, Lord. Huh? Yes, Lord. Watchmen. 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 And watchmen, a watchman don't have no respect the person who he watch. That's right. Huh? And so stay stay out of people's business. Don't fit in that. Don't, if you're supposed on. to be a watchman, listen, when that word come forth, it's going to go up the street. It's going to go in their house. Come on. It's going to go throughout their life. Come on. Listen at this. So it says... When I say unto the wicked, thou shalt surely die, mm -hmm. and thou givest him not warning, nor speak it to warn the wicked from his wicked way to what? Save his life. Come on now. The same wicked man shall die in his iniquity, but his blood will I require at thine hand. Now he telling the man of God this. Come on. Huh? Warn the wicked. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Warn. Mm -hmm. But if you don't warn it. Yes. See, that's, it's our job to warn people. Mm -hmm. When God put you over a flock of God, or you just an elder in there helping with the minister, mm -hmm. and he put this in your hand to mm -hmm. do, mm -hmm. you got to do it. You have to do it. No matter who hates you, mm -hmm. no matter who disagree with you, mm -hmm. but if I got that word to bag me up, mm -hmm. you can disagree with God all day long. That's right. Because you disagree right. with me. That's right. You want us to go to Exodus. Mm-hmm. And bring out a subject. So he told them that if you uh, don't warn them, he said the blood mm -hmm. is going to be required at thine hand. Mm -hmm. He said, yet if thou warn the wicked and he turn not from his wickedness. Mm -hmm. See, now it's not on you anymore. Come on. If you warn them and he turn not from his wickedness nor from his wicked way, mm -hmm. he shall still die. In his iniquity, but thou hast delivered thy soul. Don't you want to deliver your soul? Who wouldn't want to deliver their soul? Mm. Like me? I don't want to die and go to hell for you. Yeah. I want to tell you the truth. Mm. If mm. God give me a word, I'm supposed to deliver that word mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. with no fear, mm -hmm. with no favor, mm. with no compromise. And by doing that, mm. you deliver your soul. And so he said, now listen, he didn't lead the righteous out. Mm -mm, no, he didn't. Listen at this. Again, mm -hmm. when a righteous man does turn from his righteousness. Wait a minute. Turn from where? His righteousness. Mm -hmm. And commit iniquity. And I lay a what? A stumbling block. Some people start uh -oh. slipping and falling away from God. Mm -hmm. And you don't want to know why you blocked over here. Why Come you blocked on. over there. Why doors are shutting on you. Because people don't actually believe that the Lord will lay a stumbling block. What, in front of you. What did he just say he do to a righteous man? <laughs> it says you when, turn away from your righteousness. When you turn away. When you turn away. Mm -hmm. See, I'm not looking to turn away from this right here mm -hmm. because I want my crown. Yes. Huh? yes. I want to walk on that golden street. <laughs> I want to enter that part of the gate now. <laughs> That's right. Huh? I want to walk on that now. I want to be able to enter on that narrow road. Yes. Not the wide road where the head destruction okay? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So, but what's going on though? Well, God was showing me is a lot of preacher is not standing for the word no more. Mm -hmm. They're afraid. Mm -hmm. They just like air. Mm -hmm. Come on. They just like air. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Air was ordained from God. Yes. A, a priest. Mm. Huh? Come on. God called Moses as a prophet. That's right. He called air as a priest. Yes. They sister. A prophetess. A prophetess. She was a prophetess. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yes. They was all lined up together. Mm -hmm. He didn't separate them. They all three was together. Together. He ordained them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? To work together. To work together. Mm -hmm. But now what the error do? Is that one of the head of my sleep? <laughs> Go now to God. what the error do? <laughs> Come on. Huh? Come on. When Moses was there praying 40 days and 40 nights. Mm -hmm. Seeking the Lord. Seeking the Lord. Why did he get a word? It's the same way in this day and time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Why are you in your closet? Mm -hmm. How are you delegating yourself? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're trying to hear from God for the flock of God. Mm -hmm. Ooh, heal me, mm -hmm. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Hey, little boy, shout, shout. You're trying to hear from God. Mm -hmm. And why are you up there seeking God? They pray. Huh? Mm -hmm. They're not seeking God like you mm -hmm. do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
like the pastor do, mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. like the man of God do, mm -hmm. who is the head of the church. Mm -hmm. Come on, hear me now. Mm -hmm. Oh, I believe my place now. <laughs> Come on. Now. I the man's the head of the, <laughs> right. of the, of the church. That's right. That's God right. ordained the man. Yes. I had to throw that yes. in. Yes. Huh? yes. Even though Mary was chosen mm -hmm. huh, as a property, That's right. but she was the head. She was not the head. Moses was the head. Moses was the head. Sucker did. Yeah. Air. Mm -hmm. Okay. Amen. But at the same time, okay. Now, you, you seeking God. I got to throw this in. Men and women God is out and dedicating themselves to God, seeking God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But what is the people doing? Mm -hmm. Hmm? Hey, I'm going to tell you this. Even you got to be real careful who you sell beside you. Mm -hmm. Huh? They got to be in that same mind that you have to seek God for the people. That's right. Huh? So, okay, the reason I bring that part in mm -hmm. is because Aaron couldn't be in the same mind that Moses was in. That's, mm. He couldn't be in the same mind that Moses was in because when Moses was up fasting 40 days and 40 nights, waiting to hear God talk to him, mm. to give him a word, hallelujah, a sure word to get to the people of God, mm -hmm. the do and don't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> wait, man, the do The do's and don't. Well. The do's and don'ts. But see, people don't think it's and, the do's and, and don'ts now. Okay, now we, God, thank you for dropping that in my feet. <laughs> <laughs> the do's and don'ts. And the do's and don'ts, God gave them to Moses. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But what was going on? Mm -hmm. The people began to get weary. Mm -hmm. huh? Moses didn't die. Mm -hmm. Moses still in that place with God. Huh? In the, a matter of fact, he was in the presence he of God. He was in the presence of God. Huh? Even though the Bible say how God's back was tight for Moses. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hear me, hear me. Mm. Hear me. Huh? Hear me. Mm. He got, huh? Mm. Hey, I'm going to shot time. Huh? Because the Bible say no man has seen God. Mm -hmm. But he was in the presence of God. Huh? And he was giving himself to God mm -hmm. without eating and drinking anything. Mm -hmm. Now, these folks got to drink a water bottle mm -hmm. and even fast one day. My God, I'll be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> but this man, oh, hallelujah. But this man was seeking God. Huh? 40 days, 40 nights. 40 days and 40 nights with no food, mm -hmm. no drinking. Mm -hmm. Okay, some of y'all preach won't drink coffee while you fast. <laughs> That's not fast. Uh oh, this is for free. Huh? All right, you come want to break your body of water? Say I'm fast. Mm -hmm. No, you're not. We ain't going to no water fast. Mm -hmm. Cause Moses didn't go on water fast. Mm -hmm. He didn't go on coffee fast. Yes. He didn't go on food fast. Mm -hmm. He went on all, all day fast from yes. God. Complete. And That's you right. can do. You can fast. Yes. If I can do it, you can do it. You mm -hmm. can fast by eating, drinking. That's right. That means you kidding the flesh. Mm -hmm. huh? You presenting your body unto God. You seeking God. You giving Him His time. Mm -hmm. And this thing probably between you and God. That's right. Okay, I throw that in. <laughs> but come to Aaron. 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 Mm -hmm. And all the people. How God used him and his son in the priesthood. Now you know his son don't miss them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? That's right. With their wicked self. That's right. And see, this will go on in the church. Some people sitting they churn. Uh oh. oh Some people sitting they churn up in a position. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Aaron had two sons was Right beside him working. Yes. Huh? Come on. We talking about blood on your hand. Come on. We talking about blood. Mm hmm Come on. Huh? Mm hmm mm hmm All the wickedness mm -hmm. that they was doing before the Lord. Mm hmm Now, if I'm not mistaken, the Bible say they were sleeping at the door of the house of God with the women. Mm -hmm. Huh? And that was just at the door. <laughs> but they doing that side the door, man. Ooh. They commit these sins mm -hmm. in the house of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And get right up. Huh? They doing what they want to do in the house mm -hmm. of God. Mm -hmm. And they wash their mouth. I ain't doing nothing mm -hmm. wrong. Who? Who gonna tell me something? Who gonna tell me something? I ain't doing nothing wrong. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. I hear you hold it go. <laughs> mm. yeah. And then the Bible talk about it. How the people begin to murmur because mm -hmm. Moses didn't come back down as they opposed mm -hmm. he should come mm -hmm. down. Mm -hmm. So they went to Aaron. Mm -hmm. Huh? Moses dead. Moses, he ain't come down. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. But Moses still just seeking a good time. See, sometimes the people don't see you, my God, and see the things that God doing through you, they think you ain't in that place. Come on, mm -hmm. my time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But who know the heart? Mm -hmm. 
God do. Mm -hmm. yes, he God knows what we're seeking him. Mm -hmm. God knows how many times we talk to him a day. Mm -hmm. God knows what we read mm -hmm. it. God knows what we hate coming mm -hmm. behind He knows we pacing through the hall, mm -hmm. friend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hallelujah. Mm -hmm. This is not for man to see. Mm -hmm. Our dedication to God. That's right. Huh? Because what you do is going to come out of you. Ooh. Huh? What you do, hey, in private, hey, in private it's going to come out. The spiritual thing is going to come out higher. Mm -hmm. The spiritual thing is going to come out of you, mm -hmm. and they're going to see the dedication of God mm -hmm. in you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But now, air. Get back to air. Mm -hmm. huh? He began to listen at the people, the Bible say. Mm -hmm. huh? They began to say, we want God. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And Aaron know the commandment. That's in that bowl to no idol. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They know. They was taught to on, the church. Come on, come on. Huh? Just like we was taught, thou should not commit adultery. Mm -hmm. Thou should not steal. Mm -hmm. Thou should not, ooh, Lord. That's right, that's right. Huh? Bear false witness. Mm -hmm. Thou should not lie. Mm -hmm. Don't lie on your food stamp. Mm -hmm. Don't lie on your uh, income tax. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Look, Mama trying to help somebody now. It's income tax season. Let her, let, her, let her help you. Like my husband say, let her help you. Don't let run the Bible because you know everybody got their money. What? Come on. Huh? Come on. You know why you running with Bob? You wrong income tax time. Be so many people running with Bob. Yeah. Income tax time. <laughs> Come on, tell huh? it. Ain't nobody mad but the devil today. Come huh? on. Come on. Can I speak the truth? To speak the truth, please. Who by somebody? <laughs> Revival, 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 revival. Come on yeah, now. The income take time or no revival. Yes. Forever. Back to cornality. Back to cornality. So, back to air. The people Come said, today. bills are gold. Mm -hmm. He told them, take their earring off. Yeah. They go off. Mm -hmm. And they wonder why God don't want to wear this junk. You're <laughs> wishing it too much. Some people can't walk out the hall if they got to put earrings on you. Some people can't walk out the hall if they got to put a gold chain on your mm -hmm. neck. That gold chain don't make you nothing. That's right. What makes you is the Holy the Ghost. Holy Ghost. That's right. The inward See, thinking. this is what people got to realize. When you find yourself, mm -hmm. can't do without. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. When you find yourself, mm -hmm. that everything that I've seen, but now where the sin come in, when you can't find yourself, to do well. That's right. That balance. Huh? Okay, let me use myself for example this moment. I left my cell phone home. Mm -hmm. Flesh said, turn back around, go get it. No, I ain't going to. Mm -hmm. The spirit begin to talk. Go on. Mm -hmm. Because my phone is not my item. That's right. Come on, hear That's me now. Perfect example. Perfect huh? example. Mm -hmm. That phone can stay home. Mm -hmm. I see where mm -hmm. I get that. Mm -hmm. That's right. But I'm not going to turn back around. To do what God called me to do this yeah, morning. That's right. To go get a phone and be late that's on right. God clock. That's right. Huh? That's right. Perfect. See, you can use things. You can have things unnecessary. Don't let it have you. Don't let it have you. Mm -hmm. Don't let it take you away from God. Mm -hmm. Don't let it him, him to your walk with mm -hmm. God. So what if you don't put your necklace on? <laughs> you gonna turn back around? Oh, oh, I forgot to put my necklace on. Mm -hmm. It become an item. Mm -hmm. And that will go on with the children of Israel. Yes. Huh? The ones come say how God stripped the church. Mm -hmm. He stripped the children of Israel. He stripped them from the earring, the ankle bracelet, the mm -hmm. necklace, mm -hmm. the, the, the whatever you want to call mm -hmm. All kinds of jewelry. Right. Huh? He stripped them from every, the, the bracelet. He stripped the church down. Mm -hmm. I know they said that on me for this day and time. He stripped them down. What you think about you? Yeah. Huh? Well, anything that's written a four time is written for our life. Our life. And it's too, and that's the problem. It's too much of carnality. Mm -hmm. It's too much of worldly things. Yes. That uh, materialistic things. That sidetracking even preachers. Yes. People that God has called and ordained. Mm. You know, you ought to be able to eat folks' breakfast, wear their clothes, Come on. and get all their gifts and still tell them the truth. Tell them the truth. You can't be blinded by gifts. And, you know, Jesus is on his way back. And uh, my daughter-in-law said the other night that, people, you know, it's been said for so long, Jesus is on his way back. And so because people, it hasn't come to pass, what the Bible say, because judgment is not executed speedily. Come on, man. See, people tarry in they mess. They yeah. tarry in they sin. And so it's time for preachers to get up and stand up stand and preachers. preach the truth. Tell the truth. Preach the truth. What are you afraid of? What are you, you know, I talked about on one of my posts last night how John lost his head for the truth. 
Come on now. What 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 are you afraid of? What are you are, are you willing to lose your head for the truth? What are you afraid of? It's time to speak the truth. Mm. Speak the truth because if we don't speak the truth, we're going to have blood on our hands. Mm -hmm. Aaron let those people Come on. get in his ear. He was set as a watchman. Come on now. He was responsible for keeping things decent and in order while Moses went before the Lord for the next assignment, for the next submission. What you say? And he got sidetracked by people. You can't, we can't get sidetracked by people in this day and dumb the message down, mm. dumb the truth down because we're trying to save face with people. Yeah. I'm so glad you ain't dumb the truth down with me. I'm so glad you ain't compromised with me. Mm -mm. I'm so glad you told me like it was. You told me what I needed to know. And here I am. I'm still saved, raising children, hey, yeah, yeah. children in holiness. In, in holiness, got saved, filled with the Holy Ghost. Mm. You know, holiness is a blessing to you. Righteousness is a blessing to you. But it's like everybody is getting so touchy and so sensitive. And then I was thinking about the scripture. My daughter-in-law used that too. She uh, used to say despisers of those that are good. Yeah. Now, don't, don't take what I'm saying out of context. What I'm trying to say is people that's taking a stand in this hour, mm -hmm. people despise us. Mm -hmm. We're not light. They, you know, they, they thin and out. They don't want to be bothered with us. They don't want to be known for associating with us because we are so adamant about speaking the truth. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, we're going to have to give an account Joey. for what we are saying in the pulpit and mm -hmm. what we're not saying in well, the pulpit. Come on now. For what we're saying in the pulpit and what we're what not saying in the pulpit. And be honest, daughter, even for a man of God to be over people, it's a big responsibility. Mm hmm because he know that these people are, are he gonna be required for these people's mm -hmm, soul. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yes, that's very serious. It's, it's a serious thing to be over a flock of people. Mm -hmm. He said, "Woe unto them that scatter my flock." Mm -hmm, huh? mm -hmm, mm -hmm. See, we have to be real mindful, mindful that how we adore with the people. That's the truth. Huh? Amen. And it's a growing process, even as we 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 we'll, okay. Don't use this word. It's a it's a Growing process in with a pastor, with God put him on people, he got to learn the people, mm -hmm. huh? He got to know how, what, what to say to learn, or to learn person, you got to see their character mm -hmm. in God, mm -hmm. and you got to understand what kind of spirit they walk into. It's a lot in this whole thing yeah. when you over the flock of people. That's true. And it, you got some people will listen, you got some people not going to listen. That's right, we're for but what well, I want to speak the truth, whether they yes, hear or forbear. Yes, forbear. So it's just like with, with go, I'm sure Moses had my air going to be all these people. He going to watch the people till I come back down. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. But Joshua was standing right down there, and he heard the noise. <laughs> what kind mm -hmm. of noise that is out mm -hmm. here? Mm -hmm. He heard the noise. Mm -hmm. What kind of noise are we hearing in the church Jesus. now? Jesus. Huh? Huh? Which position are you in? Are you in Come Aaron on. position or are you in Joshua position? Which, which, Cause Joshua had an ear. Yes. And he heard the noise, and it didn't sound like the right kind of noise. Ma'am. Huh? And he looked. He heard, hey, I hear this song, but this don't sound like the right music. Mm. I hear a song and the church don't sound right no more. See, I hear the song, I see stuff, I hear stuff, I, 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 it don't sound like holiness no more. Mm -hmm. Huh? They got the rap songs in the church. Mm -hmm. Ooh, they got the praise dances in the church. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. I believe when you get filled with the Holy Ghost, he's going to give you a praise and a dance. Huh? He's going to give it to you. You ain't got to make it you up. You ain't got to make this up. <laughs> uh, well, David did. Before the Lord, he yes, was a he man did. of God. Yes. God delivered David. Mm -hmm. Huh? But at the same time, Joshua heard the noise. Mm -hmm. What the what the when he heard that noise, he knew it wasn't the right kind of music. Mm -hmm. Say something else is going on. This this is strange music. Yeah, something that has stepped in. See, you ever walked in church mm -hmm. and you can hear certain stuff mm -hmm. and you say, "Oh, this don't this don't sound right to my spirit," mm -hmm. huh? But it's the same way in that day and time. Mm -hmm. It didn't sound right to Joshua, mm -hmm. huh? And my God, what happened when him and Moses came down? Oh, the bush, I tie. He told most of them, I heard a noise. Hey! And do y'all imagine when Moses seen when he went back, 
what Aaron had done did. He did abomination thing before the Lord. Had a shot high. Mm. He began to listen at the people. They began to drink. Once the, the Bible says they began to get naked. Mm -hmm. Oh, all the ungodness mm -hmm. is beginning to come in the house mm -hmm. of God, even this day and time. My God, huh? you can come like you want to come. You can dress like you want to dress. You can look like a hearted. Mm -hmm. huh? You can talk like a hearted. You can use all those slang words to come. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's no different. No different. Huh? Same God. The same God. Mm -hmm. But the Bible talks about how, my God, when, he, when, when Moses came down there, he began to see that error went in error. Mm -hmm. What the world you did, Aaron? I left you to watch over the flock of God. Why did you do this, Aaron? Nobody want to be held accountable. Nobody want to be. The people made me. Mm. You mean say the people make you do something? Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody gonna make me do nothing. That's right. If it's against the word, you cannot you cannot force me. Mm -hmm. I tell people right now, don't play me when it comes down to work, because I ain't doing. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing what you do because you do it. That's right. I'm not doing it because we close to each other. Yes. Long as I know the truth, mm -hmm. I'm not you not supposed to do what I do mm -hmm. if it's not right. That's right. Huh? That's right. I tell you, raise your faith. You don't support if I go in air mm -hmm. and start back decking myself up. Mm -hmm. You might not do it. That's right. Oh. Hey, That's right. Shot, shot. Huh? That's right. You should come and say, Mama, you need to be restored. Yes. Oh, yeah, mm. yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody need to tell their pastor, you need to be restored. Yes. Huh? Somebody need to tell the proper tent, you need to be restored. Huh? Yes. My God, you don't got your hair bushed off. Huh? Yes. You don't you're look like you know. In the way you don't stand. stand. What happened to holiness? Mm -hmm. See, the Bible say put a difference between clean, clean and unclean. Mm -hmm. Holiness and unholiness. Mm -hmm. It's a difference. It is a difference. One scripture talking about the tie or a hold, a mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? That's right. Do you know where I looked at that before I got saved? Do you think I want to go back and put my tight jeans on? Mm -hmm. And now the preacher's wife is in the church wearing a two piece pants suit. My God, hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Don't make me call this stuff up because I do it now. My God, this will go on with the church now. Mm -hmm. And we're going to the scripture. How the Bible say God put a skirt on the church. Mm -hmm. Huh? He dressed the church. Mm -hmm. Covered them. He covered them. Why he used the word skirt when he was talking to the church in Israel? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. He said, I put a skirt on you to protect you. Mm -hmm. But now you know what happened to the church. They took their skirt off. Mm -hmm. They begin to play with the devil. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. This is what's going on. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yeah. But when Moses went down, mm -hmm. and he seen the people, they were drunk. They was partying. Mm -hmm. They was all on the golden cattle, yes. praising him. Yes. Huh? But you know what Moses had something for them? God told him. Hey, little shot. He said, everybody that bowed down to this cow. Mm. Huh? What he told him to do, knock it down, mm -mm. Huh? melt it down. Mm -hmm. huh? Now you drink your, yes. you drink your yes. God, yes. you drink the your God, huh? you drink the business of your God. Huh? You bow down, you worship this. Now I'm gonna melt this down, cause God command. I'm gonna melt this down. Mm -hmm. You deserve to drink your, yes. your God. Yes, you gonna drink it, huh? You gonna drink it? They drunk it. You gonna drink it? And many of them died. Ooh, my say, yes, God. Many of them died. Mm -hmm. And that's what wrong Ooh, with the church. Huh? They fall after the devil. That's who they God mm -hmm. is. The Bible says the God of this world had blinded their eyes. Mm -hmm. Other words, it took them back from holiness. Mm -hmm. And it turned them back to the world. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's the right. God of this world. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He'll deceive them. Yes. Huh? Just like he came to Eve in the garden and told her that you're going to be, if you eat this fruit, if you eat this, mm -hmm. you're going to become wise. Mm -hmm. He didn't tell she was going to die, did he? Huh? He didn't warn her that she was going to die. Mm -hmm. But guess who warned her? God warned mm -hmm. her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Woo! Before the devil came to her, who yes. warned her? Yes. God plain told him, you eat every tree. Yes. But the tree in the midst, he said, don't touch, touch it. Not. That's right. You Not only don't eat it, he said, don't, don't touch, touch it. it. Don't touch it. That's right. I'm bringing out whatever God told me, bring by spirit. It's the spirit of rebellious in the land. Yes. And they refuse to walk in the word, in the truth. 
Because the Bible says heaven and earth are going to pass away, but God's word is going to stand for what? Ever. And one scripture say the word already been established in heaven. Yes. Huh? Yes. And one scripture say it's set in heaven. It's set. Huh? It's already set. So you can't change the word. Huh? You're yes. going to obey the word or you're going to be disobedient to the word. I wanted to read this, Mama. In Corinthians, he said, this is Paul. He said, would to God ye could bear with me a little in my folly. Mm -hmm. He said, and indeed, bear with me. Bear with me. For I am jealous over you mm. with godly jealousy. Mm. He says, for I have espoused you to one husband. To what? One husband. Mm -hmm. That I may present you as a chaste virgin to Christ. Mm -hmm. He said, but I fear least by any means as the serpent beguiled Eve through his subtlety. So your minds should be corrupted from the simplicity that is in Christ. And so that's what's being done today. Uh, true ministers of the gospel that's been called out to preach separation, to preach and show the people of God that they need to stand out and be a difference in the world. The enemy, just like he beguiled Eve, mm -hmm. he has come in and he has, it, like it says, corrupted you. From your simplicity that is in Christ. Yes. It doesn't matter how bad, how much we get upset. There is simplicity yes. in Christ. Yes. It doesn't matter how bad it offends us. There is simplicity in Christ. God is calling us back to simplicity. God wants there to be a difference in the world and the church. Sure. There is a crystal clear difference between the world and the church. Mm -hmm. And preachers, you're going to have blood on your hand. You, you got to be strong. You got to. It's like. I'm starting to see preachers do things that I've never imagined in the body of Christ today. It's like there's so much compromise mm. and I'm not judging. I'm seeing, I'm seeing, I have a watch for eye and I'm seeing you're changing. Yes. You're conforming to yes. the world. That's what the Bible says. Come on now. It says be not conformed to the Come world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. And so now people is coming off the street and they're not being transformed. God transformed me by Come the on. renewing of my mind. But now people are coming out of the world and they are conforming. The church is conforming to the to, people. To the world. They the, the, to the, world. the church is conforming to the people. We're supposed to be bringing a people out, out of, of the, the world. world. Come on. And now the people are coming out of the world and coming in the church and the church is conforming to the people. Yes. That's not the way God set this up. So we're going to have blood on our hands because now. You can smoke and be saved. You can cuss and be saved. Fornicate. You can fornicate and be saved. Adultery. You can commit adultery and be saved. You can do the boogie loop. I danced when I was in this world what till 5 o'clock in the morning one night. Say? I did the boogaloo all night long. And you know the boogaloo all night long. You had to been drinking yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Listen, you're going to tell me you can do the boogaloo and still be saved. You, know. you can do all these things and, and still, still say slow. that you are saved. Come on, people. Come on. It's the truth. This Bible talks about itching ears. That's what the scriptures say. You want something to tickle your fancy. You don't want to be disturbed. You don't want to be interrupted. We want to do everything that we can do and still say that we are saved. Hmm. Say what? Do everything that you're big enough to do and still say that you are saved. I beg your pardon. Absolutely. The Bible says a corrupt tree cannot bear for good fruit. That's right. And a good tree cannot bear for corrupt fruit. That's right. That's you right. will know them by their yeah, fruit. fruit. So therefore, I don't even try to explain to people. Um, um, no, I ain't judging nobody. I'm saying what the Bible right. says. You ain't judging nobody. We yes. say what the words say. That's right. See, the Bible says you'll know them by their fruit. Now, God gave me that one day. He said, he let me look at that real clearly. You will know a preacher by their fruit. By their fruit mm -hmm. because it's going to show. Yes. What's in a man is going to yes. manifest on the outside. That's right. That's right. Bishop Clifton Jones said something one day and it is so powerful. He said, if you and your crew outnumber me and my crew, me and my crew going to go somewhere else. In other words, he was saying he was not going to let a few people contaminate Come him and move him off of what God commanded you him to it. stand on. And we got to take a stand. And some of you preachers, you, you just, you, 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 you're not taking a stand. You're not, you're not standing the way you used to. And I know this upset and I know, no, you know, nobody is saying this, you know, but you, it's, you, the you, anyway. it, it, it's the truth anyway. Blood is on, Blood your, is hands. on your hands. Blood on your hands. What most, what God showed me, what most of the preachers is all for a daughter is money. Mm -hmm. It's gimmick.
kind of business. No. I have ran. I didn't run revival for money. I ran. I always told God, if I run revival, at least one soul need to get filled with the Holy Ghost. Yes. And it never failed me that one soul or two soul got filled with the Holy Ghost. Yes. That's what revival is for, to revive the people. To revive people. The higher, to deliver people. Yes. You know the most shy yes. know, it's not for just money. Yes. And the Bible says, if you want to stick with the word, and just always stick with me, and God has manifested that to me because he do it for me. My God, hallelujah. God has showed, has spoke to me. He said, this is my word. Mm -hmm. huh? And the word that he had gave me one day, he said, just like I told my disciples, go. Don't take no purse. Mm -hmm. Don't take no script. Mm -hmm. Don't take nothing with you. That's right. Huh? That's right. And when they came back, he asked them a question. Mm -hmm. Have you lacked anything? See, God let me know that you won't lack nothing when you be submissive to your witness. true living God. That God will always have a blessing waiting for you. I'm a blessing. And I am a witness. My husband been in ministry going on 18 years. And he have yet to take up a sugar offering, a copper offering, a special offering. And people, man of ministry, sometimes he still forget to take up the offering. And one of the ushers have to give him, hey, we forgot the offering. He be getting ready to dismiss the church. Because he forget the offer. That's because he work him. and he take care of his own mm. family. He's not trying to fleece the flock. He's right. not trying to get uh, uh, what what people have. And he's not going to let the money change his message. Come on now. And so many preachers in the body of Christ have let money change your message. You letting money change you. I'm a witness. God will bless you. He will get you out of debt. God will do so many things for you, and you do not have to compromise holiness. You do not have to take down on God's message. You don't have to take down on God's Nothing. word. And I, I just want to encourage the body today. Yes. You know, I want to encourage the preachers. I'm talking, to, I always say, I'm talking to the preachers that, that was bold enough to get on the live, and I'm talking to the preachers that sitting outside <laughs> the live. You know, they sit outside the live because they yeah. don't want you to know they, that you're on yeah, the live. Yeah. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to the ones that would that, 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 that dare to come on the live. And I'm talking to the ones that's outside the live. You got to take a stand for righteousness in this day. You got you to gotta give an account for what you're doing and how you're changing. Amen. You're changing. You're changing. And you can see it. You're changing. You're changing. Some of them try to think they got a blind eye to it. They see what they feel from mm -hmm. But they not humble enough to say and admit it. I fail. I need to come back up, Lord. Yes. See, cause you ain't got to do this. You ain't got. You ain't got to confess to a man, woman, what you did. But you need to go to God. But when you go to God, it's a change gonna come. Yes. Everything is coming now. It used to be certain places say people didn't go. Now they go. It, it used to be say certain things say people didn't do. Now yeah. you you can you can get a, a tattoo in the name of Jesus. My God. But when I got saved, you know, you can change what you've done before, but no. you ain't trying to put it on no, blast. No, you know, it's like it's so much, and it's, it's not y'all. You don't supposed to perish your body, or you don't supposed to mark your body. Y'all, we doing too much in the name of Jesus. What, like my husband said, what we gonna do now? Start hooking in the name of Jesus. <laughs> We finna come on, people. It's like it's like it's so much com it's so much compromise. It's so much. It's so in the body of Christ, and nobody wants anybody to say anything. Everybody wants to hush. No, it's time to cry loud and spare not, and lift up our voice like a trumpet. I just thank God for it. Go ahead, Mama. But it's it's good. It's good because when you was talking, the Bible say the scripture come to me. The Bible say, "Well, man." What well, well if a man prosper the whole world? Mm -hmm. huh? What if you preach it? Yes, you prosper a whole lot of money. You're preaching the people. Huh? you getting the money. But what if that going to prosper you? What if that going to prosper your soul? Yes. If you gain the whole world, still lose your soul. You lose your soul. Huh? Yes. You're still going to die one day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you can die like a fool. And Lord, uh, ooh. You know, it's just like. They think they're getting away. I don't believe, I believe that any of them took some of these preachers' mind and make them feel like ain't nothing going to happen to them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, huh? God won't expose me. And then they got this thing. I know I'm blessed. You blessed when God wake you up, but is you going to continue to be blessed if you're not, you, is you going to be blessed enough to go to heaven? Mm -hmm. Huh? Yes. Yes, God reigns on the just and the unjust. That's he right. blessed all of us. Mm -hmm. But because God reigns on the sinner? That do that make them do that make them gonna go to hell? Right. No. That's right. Huh? He he's just every merciful. Every other field. He's just so merciful. He's a merciful he's so God. Kind. And he's trying to give all of us a chance to come up higher. 
to get in our right place with God. And that's what we come here today. That's what the spirit of truth is about. Yes. It's about the truth. I heard a, a man of God, and I love him dearly, but he was saying how he said God told him uh, when he was going through his deliverance uh, to transition from one type of cigarette to a different type of cigarette. And it just, it, it brought tears to my eyes because, you know, God, he, he, he told us to repent. Sure did. He told us to repent when that, it, okay, when I first came in, I was doing this and I was doing this and then, well, the then was when you repented. Come on. Everything before that, you had not repented. Mm. Repent. The Bible say repent. Yes. And repent means to do an about face. Turn around. It means to turn around. And when it say godly sorrow, okay. work of repentance. Mm -hmm. And so when you become godly sorrow, you don't want to live in sin anymore. No, you no. don't want to do those things mm -hmm. anymore. And then. The scripture says that God does not tempt man with sin. No, the scripture says. How say. dare you tell the people of God that God is telling you, okay, all right, so I'm I'm hooking. So, you know, don't, I know you're doing three men a month. So just drop it down to uh uh one and then, then I'm going to deliver you. That's what the Bible talk about, denying the power thereof. You trying to tell me that God can't deliver somebody from a cigarette? He delivered me. Listen, but guess what? You got to repent of that Come cigarette. Come on now. You got to repent. He ain't going to come and snatch nothing out of your mm -hmm. hand. You got to put that thing down. So, yeah, and, I, you know, we got we got to be careful with what we are allowing in this day and age. Mom, did you have anything, uh, any other verses that you... Well, uh, the, uh, probably a little bit concerning this, the, uh, how God covered the church. How God covered the to church. In, in Ezekiel. Mm -hmm. I want to get this out and ask you looking up that. Uh, that's what... the I won't steal your side. I don't know why it's by error, but uh, that's what's going on with a lot of preachers now. They give in too much to the people. Mm -hmm. They doing what the people say do. They doing what they think the people, uh, what the people want them to do. Yeah. They want to have their way. But what did God set you up to do? God set you up to lead the people in the word of God. Yes. The word is a map unto heaven. And we got to obey every word. They come out that Bible. That's we right. come into the knowledge of the truth. Ezekiel 16? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which words you want me to start with? Uh, I thought I had more. Uh, let me see. Mm -hmm. When he saw them uh, polluted in their blood, you got, and when I passed by thee and saw thee polluted in thine own blood, I said unto thee, when thou was in thy blood, live, and yea, I said unto thee, when thou was in thy blood, live. Uh, and then eight, verse 8 says, And when I passed by thee and looked upon thee, behold. Oh, that's where I want to start. I got a more. Verse 8. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now when I passed by thee and looked upon thee, behold, thy time was the time of love. Mm -hmm. And I spread my skirt over thee. Wait a minute. That time was what? A time of love. It was a time of love, right? Mm -hmm. You know how mm -hmm. much we... It was a time that God, people used to love God so much. Mm -hmm. It was a time of love. Mm -hmm. You loved him so much. There was nothing you wouldn't do for the Lord. There was nothing you would do for the Lord. You wouldn't be scared of preaching the truth. You wouldn't, you wouldn't let nobody put you in, in the corner. Mm -hmm. It just said the Lord, no matter you hate me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But what happened now? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. He said, and I spread my skirt over thee. He spread his skirt over the, over the, over the children of Israel. Huh? Yes. Otherwise, he spread his skirt to cover their what? Yes, their sins. It's going to tell you what it did for And cover their nakedness. See, that's why he spread the skirt over. He spread over to cover their nakedness. Mm -hmm. He didn't want their nakedness show. He didn't want, he didn't, he didn't want them to be seen. Mm -hmm. huh? <laughs> he wanted them to stay that virgin. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's why he said, I'm coming back for a church without a spot, spot, without a blemish, without a wrinkle. Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. He coming back for a clean bride of the yes. world. Yes. Huh? That bride that got that pretty white gown on, mm -hmm. that pretty white gummy on, mm -hmm. with nothing on it, no rank or no nothing. That's right. Huh? That's why he was using this for example, how he spread the skirt over to mm -hmm. cover what? To cover their nakedness. To cover their nakedness. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Yea, I swear unto thee and entered into a covenant with thee. See, he swear unto them. Mm -hmm. They enter to a covenant with them. Mm -hmm. Just like a husband and wife. Mm -hmm. When they say I do, they don't make a covenant mm -hmm. one to another. Mm -hmm. Hey. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Huh? They don't make a covenant to one to another. Mm -hmm. See, me and my husband was one. Mm -hmm. Woo! Hallelujah. You and your husband is one. Mm -hmm. Hey, you made a covenant when you say I do. Mm -hmm. That's right. Huh? That's Go ahead. Right. And he said he made a covenant with thee, said the Lord, mm -hmm. and thou became his mine. 
See, yeah. you become. Yeah. You become your husband. Why? Mm -hmm. Just like when God created Adam, he seen that he was alone. He made a woman. Mm -hmm. Huh? And they become what? One. one. He said, leave thy father and thy mother, and mm -hmm. you come one. Mm -hmm. It's the same way with God. You got to leave the world alone That's to right. become one with God. That's right. Yes. You got to leave the world alone to come one with, with God. God. That's right. Ooh. Yes. God is dropped in my spirit. Yes, that's huh? beautiful. That's, that's beautiful. how you become one with God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Because he don't make a covenant with you. Mm -hmm. And you're supposed to keep that covenant. Keep it. But so many people don't broke the covenant. Broke the covenant. Don't Ooh, my broke son. the yes, marriage son. up. Mm -hmm. huh? Ooh, they don't step down on God. Mm. They don't got beside they say. Mm. They begin to undress. They, yeah. they begin to take their stay off. Yeah. Huh? They begin to show their nakedness. Mm -hmm. They begin to lie back and let the devil mm -hmm. rape them. Mm -hmm. Hey! Mm -hmm. Begin to let the devil rape them mm -hmm. and strip them down. Mm -hmm. Then what the talk about? Then I wash thee with water. I wash thee with water. We've been clean through that living water. Mm -hmm. Huh? If it rises up in like a living river with water, it is shut up higher. Mm -hmm. Just like the woman mm -hmm. was at the well. Mm -hmm. Huh? Jesus was standing right there. Huh? She said, you know, we don't have nothing to do with y'all. <laughs> That's right. Huh? That's, how, that's how it is with real preachers today. That's how it is with real preachers. I ain't got nothing to do with y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all preach too hard. Mm -hmm. Y'all tell the word too much. Tell but that's what God called us to do. That's right. Huh? She was standing right back there telling Jesus, mm -hmm. we ain't got nothing to do with y'all mm -hmm. Samaritan. Mm -hmm. But he said, if you had known me, mm -hmm. <laughs> you would ask me for this Ooh. living. You would ask me a water. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes, Lord. And some of y'all preachers, we're here when we yes. stand. And the Bible says, you would ask the Lord. Ooh, you took it right out of my mouth, glory. Huh? Ooh, nah, some of you preachers, if you had asked God Ooh. for some of this wisdom, this word that Jesus. God had put in Jesus. us, Jesus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ha, ha. He called on those boys. Hallelujah. You can feel that living water. Yeah. Come up from the stomach to the Glory to God. Mm, I see. Yeah, Lord. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Beautiful now. Ah. Oh, my high. Yes. Yes, God. Yes, God. Ask. No, no, yeah, ha. He said you have not because you asked now. That's right. She, Ooh. if that woman was at the well, if she would have had sick enough, she would have shut her mouth up. Yeah. She didn't know who she was talking to. Mm. She was talking to the living water. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, that hallelujah. Water that you can drink. Jesus. That you'll never, th Ooh. that you'll never thirst. Yes, thirsty. God. Hallelujah. You'll never thirst. Hallelujah. Again. Oh, Ooh. you know why the preacher don't yes, got God. thirsty? You mm. know why they don't got thirsty? Because they stopped drinking the living water. Yes. They stopped. Ooh, yes, God. Oh, Hallelujah. God. Hey, they yes, stopped Lord. drinking that living water. Mm. Huh? They let that living water go, and now they got dead water. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Don't bring no life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't huh? bring no life. Mm. And I got news for you. That living water is the Holy Ghost. Yes. If you don't have that water, who come up with that? You want to, what they call that? What they is? Jesus, that's water. Mm, dehydrated. You want to be dehydrated. So we so all preach a dehydrated. Jesus. Y'all dehydrated. Yes. I say, y'all dehydrated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't have that living water no yeah. more. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Jesus, and she would have asked him. Oh, my see, yeah, 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 yeah. She had the living water. She was dehydrated. Mm. Uh, mm. She was dehydrated spiritually. Spiritually. She was going there to get that, that, hey. that, 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 that regular water. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Ooh, water. yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? Mm. She said, you know, we don't have no dealing with you. Huh? Mm. Uh, why is she but Jesus said, you have known me. Yeah. You want to ask me. Yeah. On this water. Ooh. Yeah. Yes, Lord. Yeah. 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 Hallelujah. Yeah. Thank you, hey, Jesus. Jesus. I don't got hype for who Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. 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 Thank you, Thank you, God. 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 Restore me, Lord. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. Restore ha. me, Lord. Yes. Restore me with the Holy Ooh, nah. Ghost. Let that living water come up again, Lord. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Yes. Ooh, I feel the Holy Ghost. Yes. I say I feel the Spirit of God. Yeah, Lord. I feel the Spirit of yeah, God. Lord. Yeah, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't want my water to go out. Mm. Here. I don't want no leaking. Mm. Like David said here. Let my cup run over. Yes. Yeah. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow, follow me all, all the days, days of my, of my life. life. Let that water, Lord, mm -hmm. let it overflow, Lord. Yes. Let it soak me real good yes. from the inside to the yes. outside. Let it overflow. That means come on the outside. Yes. And you yes. might see Ooh. the glory of God uh, upon your life. Yes, yes, uh, yes. I ain't got to walk up to nobody tell them I got the Holy Ghost.
go. Let it be a shadow of fire. It's somebody that live with you. Yeah, hallelujah. They're gonna bring you. They're gonna stir you up. They're gonna make you be who God called you to be. That's right. They're gonna make you tell the truth. Whether you be hated or whether you be loved. Yeah, that's all right with me. I'm gonna tell the truth to get the blood off my hands. Yes, yes. I feel something. I feel the spirit of God tell you about shot tie you about higher. This is what the people need. They need truth. It's preacher. They dehydrated. Yes. They dehydrated. You know why they dehydrated? Because they start drinking the wrong stuff. Yes. People drink too many soda. Yes. Hey. Too many sweets. To yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. You get Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Know, huh? but yes. Yes. Your body's made out of water. Come on. 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 Ooh, Lord, thank you, Jesus. I feel the spirit of God on my heart. God want truth to come out. God want these preachers to know her. You dehydrated. Yes. You know why you dehydrated? My God, huh? Instead of you preaching the truth, huh? You preach a lie, huh? Yes. Then you're the Baha'i, huh? Ooh, you high, compromise, high. huh? Higher Baha'i, huh? And people know what kind of fruit you got, huh? People know you don't change, huh? If I change right now, my whole family will know I'm back Yeah, sleep. Lord. My whole family know I don't back sleep. Yeah. Uh, that's why the Bible says, we come to a shot right? If any man Jesus Christ, huh, he he's is a, a new creature. creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things become, become new. new. See, I don't have that old woman no more. Mm. You know why? Because that living, 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 old shot. Hey, glory. Mm. That living water is living in me. My God. It's living in me. Yeah. My well don't Ooh, go dry. Yes, God. My well don't go dry. Woo! But see, she went to that way. Yeah. And that living water standing right before you. Woo! My little but God. Jesus made her out of belief. Yeah. He told her how many of her was yeah. See, it's talking about that living water. Huh? It rebuked you. Oh, yeah. I'll tell that living water rebuke her. I can't stay still. Let him have his way. Let him have his way. See, that living water, water. See, that living water begin to reveal now. Yeah. yeah. Let you know what kind of place you in. You better let him have his way. You better let him have his way. That living water begin to reveal to her. Yeah. You got five of them. Yeah. And where you with her? Ain't none of y'all got yours. Come on. Hallelujah. My God. Yeah. She couldn't hold that. She had to run to a stone. Yeah. Run to the city. Oh, my God. You see this man? Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey. Hallelujah. Yeah. I'm talking about that living water. Yeah. Mighty God. My God. That's what these hey. these souls supposed to be doing come on, when now. they come and contact with the truth. My uh, God, they're supposed to run, on. my God, on, and go tell it on a mountain. Yeah, 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 yeah. My see how and Woo. duplicate other delivered souls. My, oh, my God. God, it's time to tell truth. It's time people tell truth now. They won't shake the women's up, but that's all right. God put the word on my mouth to say, just at the Lord. Yes. You bunch of hypocrites. You bunch of backsliders. Yes. God said, come back to me. Yes. God said, repent and come back. Come on. Come on, my shot time. Oh, look, like everything going well there. But it's a day going to come. My God, it's prophesy. It's a day going to come. Yeah, yeah, ha. Huh? It's, it's a day going to come. Prophesy. All you preachers. Yeah, yeah. All you hands. Yeah, hey, yeah. All you backslide. It's a day going to come. And you ain't going to know when that day going to sneak up on you. The Bible says no man know the hour or the time. Huh? You don't know when your time going to be up. Huh? You need to repair yourself. Ooh, my, my, my. You need to add your shut up shot tire. You need to ask God huh, to forgive you. Fall back on your knees huh, and confess your fault. Huh? Confess your sins unto him. Mm -hmm. I I guarantee you, when you confess your sins unto him, huh, he'll restore you. Come on, boss. Mm. He'll come on. God yes. wants somebody to get this. Yes. God wants somebody to come on huh, and get restored. Huh? Yes. God wants you to be restored. Yes. Huh? He said, I got my hand stretched out to you. Who come on, shot tie? Huh? He come on, she come on, high. Huh? He said, come up to me. Huh? Oh, you the heaven heart. Huh? They leave me the shot to the high. He said, I will give you rest in your soul. See, your soul is weary right now. Yes. But you need the Holy Ghost. Yes. You need that living water. Yes. Down in your soul. Yes. God want them to know. Yes. It's time for these preachers to get right. Mm -hmm. huh? It's time for these preachers. Well, I'm going to lose my member. 
So lose them. Mm -hmm. So lose them. You got to get back on the old path. The old path. You got to get back on the old way. Yes, God. Because it's a highway. It should be called homeless. Yes. You know about no that. clean thing. Yes. I don't care how much you prophesy. I don't care how much you preach. Because they ain't going to get you your help. Huh? That's right. You come about high. Huh? I don't care how many visions you have. I don't care how many dreams you have. God showed me something about that. Huh? So you can have all these gifts. And you can still die and go to hell. That's right. That's why he said, me and I'm going to say, Lord, Lord. Lord, Lord. How about prophesy your night? Oh, you doing good prophesy. Yes. But if you living the life. Huh? If you telling the people the Preach. truth. Oh, my God. Huh? He going to say, me because of a shot. Huh? Me and I'm going to say, Lord, Lord, huh? how we prophesy your night? How we cast devils out? Huh? He said, I never knew you. You work iniquity. You put a sin. Huh? Yes. You put adultery. Yes. You put a fornication. Yes. You put a lie. Yes. You put a pretendence. Yes. Hallelujah. Just because you prophesied. Let me tell you a little story about me. When I was out there in the world, I went to a vision standing on a corner. I ain't know what a vision was. I ain't Come know on. nothing about the spiritual thing. The only thing I know, I seen myself. It was daylight. Come on. Come on. It was daylight. Come on. So if y'all want to live off vision, I'm going to tell you, don't do it. You better live by the word of God. You better live according to what the word says. Go over higher because all this stuff, he's going to perish one day. Mm -hmm. Even the vision going to cease. Yeah. Even the dream going to mm -hmm. cease. Even mm -hmm. the prophecy going to mm -hmm. cease. Mm -hmm. So that's not standing. The Bible says the word going to stand forever. Mm -hmm. It's already stepped in heaven. But let me tell you this right here. If you're going to live off that dream, the vision, and you're getting happy because somebody prophesied to you, let me share a little light to you. Okay, well, I was out there in the world. Yeah. Let me share my testimony. Come on, tell, hey, out of my tell life. it. That's why God made me who I am come today. On, come on, because come I can on. tell you something. Yes. When I was out there in the world, huh, I think I was about 19 years old, 20 years old. I was walking, and I was going to my cousin's apartment on the other side of the highway. And when I got on that corner, my body began, my body shut down, and it was like a big old scream. I could see myself running from a white car with a breaking the top on it. Come on, my come on, God, come on. Huh? And the vision, it, 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 like my body just got loose. Mm -hmm. The vision shut down. And I sat there and pondered, what did I just see? And sure enough, I crossed where I got in the middle of that highway. A white car with a brain at the top came from nowhere trying to run me down. Come on. Just the way I seen that vision. Come on. But did that say that? Did, is that going to make me get heaven? Because all out there, I seen your vision. Come on. No, that's not going to make me get heaven because I seen your vision. It's not going to make me get heaven because I had dreams that came to pass while I was out there in the world. Let me tell you, so I was still was on my way to hell. Yes. I, I was still on my way to hell. So I don't go by just dreams and visions. I don't go by, by just all that kind of stuff. Because I know heaven and earth going to pass away. I know all that stuff going to be ceased. Mm -hmm. It's a guilt without repenting. That, that is. Huh? It's a gift without, without repenting. repenting. So, yes, a preacher been in church long enough, and they even a back. I don't see a backslide prophesy. Oh, yeah. Let me tell you something. A backslide prophesy to a sister. Yeah. And she was going to be a red car, and she got that red car. But that don't mean he was going to heaven. I don't know. Yeah. I said, that don't mean he was going to heaven. He could have lived a shot on high, y'all. He could have been shot he was backslid. Yes. So, if you're going to live out prophecy and dreams and visions, they go and find that right for place. Yeah. But let me tell you something. I don't just live by that. That's I right. live by the word. Yes. Yes. Huh? What the words say. And I'm gonna tell you another thing. Well, I got I did well, I got pregnant with my oldest daughter. I ain't know what I was having. My uncle was gone with uh, uh, this woman, she was an alcoholic and she was drunk. And you know that alcoholic looked at me. She told me you're gonna have a girl. And what did I had I had a girl, but that don't mean she was going to hell with me. That's right. So we're gonna live off that kind of stuff right there. You on your way to hell. That's you right. gotta believe what the words say. You gotta believe on the son of God. Huh? You got to live what the words say. The Bible says don't just be a hearer of the word, but he said be a doer of his word. See, I won't be a doer of this word. I don't want to just be preaching a word that I'm not living. Mm. Don't try. Mm. Mm. Hey, this was wrong with the church now. Yes. Huh? Oh my goodness. This is what wrong with the church now. Oh, he gave me a word. Hey, that's good and fine. But what you living? What you living? But I'm going to tell you something. God don't took me into preachers' houses. God don't took me into preachers' churches. I don't see stuff. Not being there. Mm -hmm. huh? and, right. and, they, and God will bring it out. He will build. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hallelujah. So we're going to go by that right there. Let me tell y'all something. Everybody that preaching word, and I don't hear some preacher preach, don't commit adultery, but they ain't commit adultery. Mm -hmm. huh? mm -hmm. So you think that you think about this preaching the word too? See, he said, that's why he said, don't just be a hearer, but you got to be a doer of this word. Doer. Huh? Yes. 
Ooh, I know I got off that word right there. My, my, that you okay. got on the Holy Ghost. That was the that Holy was God. that was off the press, and Ooh. we thank God thank for Lord. it. Ooh. We just thank God for the Holy Ghost Ooh, that Lord, stepped in. The, the, the my <laughs> God, God, that's what that's what the importance of being my led God. by the Spirit of God. Yes, Lord. And we thank God for this opportunity Ooh. today to yes, Lord, come before you God. about the blood dripping off of preacher's hand. Ooh. The Bible say the husband man is first Great partaker part of the fruit, and so we just thank God for that. And listen, y'all need to go read that story with that at that well. The Holy Ghost came to talk mm. to us about that. He about go read that, yeah, and see how she took responsibility for her action, mm. and she uh, was uh, went forth and made that change. Yeah, she didn't justify her action mm -mm. when the truth came. She went and told it. Woo! We told it. So let God be true and every man a lie. And y'all know what I love to say. Mm -hmm. We are not talking to you unless we talking to you. <laughs> we ain't talking to you unless we talking to you. All right now. Unless you guilty of what's being said, we ain't talking to you. All right now. So y'all. Listen, be encouraged. Thanks for everybody that tuned in today. Amen. I thank God for I this woman, God. God. <laughs> Lord, Lord. Thank God for her. I and get a little excited, but that's all right. It's Listen, all Jesus. so so y'all see where that uh that it trickled down where I came from. So I, look, I can't help myself because the apple don't fall too far <laughs> from the tree. So I just thank God for Mother being here today. I appreciate her, friend. her entire family. Thank God for my husband Amen. and all thank of you that John. chimed in today. Y'all have a blessed day, and thank you again for tuning in to the Spirit of Truth podcast.